Uh, it started just a couple weeks ago. Uh, Coach Tapp brought it in, and uh, he just was trying to resemble old school. And uh, this new, new green hat, so uh, he brought it in for us before one game, and it's kind of stuck. And so now, just like in New York, uh, where they give out the Broadway hat, it's the same with that guy passes it on. Every what does it mean to clinch the uh, top seed this early, <coughs> two games ago? I think it's big, but uh, you know it's good. We celebrated it, and uh, I think we still got a lot, a lot of work left. So it's good. It's good for our class. We get to celebrate it at home. We never have something we never got to do. But uh, like I said, yeah, we got, uh, we still got a lot of work to do. So uh, it's not over yet. Was it? You know, after the game is over, you guys are just standing around there. Uh, maybe I'll, I'll ask Mike this. You guys are standing around, you know, waiting for this game. Then the, the Cornell Quinnipiac game. What was the mood like there? Uh, Obviously, a little, a uh, lot of anticipation. It was a long 40 seconds, but uh, uh, it, was, it was a great feeling to win, win at home, and it was pretty special. I mean, it's my first time here, and I thought it was really awesome. Let's celebrate a little bit, but Shane said it best. It's just the beginning. We've got a long road to go. Shane, talk about that second period, about a seven minute stretch. You get three goals to put it away. I mean, how's it? feel as a team, you guys get rolling like that and you jump the lead from one to four goals? I mean, it's big for us. Um, we've lost um, some leads here of late when we had uh, two goal leads and it was important for us to uh, stick the dagger in them as early as we could and we stuck to it and uh, we had a big second period. You know, tonight, special teams, you got a power play goal, short and a goal. You got goals everywhere you could tonight. He's talking about just the whole team effort, you know. Shut up. Uh, yeah, definitely. It starts with Steve-O back there. I mean, uh, he's playing big for us all year and have a late. He's, uh, I'm glad we gave him an easy game for him tonight. And uh, special teams, uh, we've been struggling of late, but it was definitely good to pick it up there at the uh, the end and uh, get one on the PK and on the peeper. Kyle, for you, and then, you, know, you only faced nine shots through t two periods. What is that like? How do you have to manage to you know, stay mentally sharp? Yeah, you know, uh, like Shane said, uh, the boys made it really easy for me tonight. Blocked a ton of shots. Uh, our D zone coverage, I thought, was great throughout the whole game, and uh, yeah, so I just tried to stay mentally mentally sharp back there. Dan, let's talk about the two goals you scored there. The first one was a two on one. It looked like you know Matt could have shot the puck when he tried to pass it back to you, but you know, talk about that whole play there. Yeah, I was just, uh, I was just a normal two on one up until uh, I think I think it was the break that that stopped it. Uh, I didn't really know what the other back checker was doing. I guess he tried to take my stick and he kind of slipped up and uh, saw the puck was standing there and I figured I'd just fire it on net from the slot. And uh, I guess good things happen when you shoot. Wasn't sure if it was going to count, but uh, Nap came over and said that uh, the new rule counts. So. Had it been international, it was like the Olympics, you wouldn't have counted. <laughs> yeah, no, uh, that, uh, that's why I asked him. I didn't know the, I didn't know the ruling, but apparently it's, it's, that's, that's a good goal. It looked like the bad angle on the second goal. Yeah, I didn't mean to, you know, that wasn't supposed to go in. I was supposed to go to Cruz. I mean, the uh, guy got his skate in there. Um, just a broken play. So, uh, but <clears throat> goes in and, uh, you know, that, that gave us a huge boost, I think, and, you know, put up 3 nothing. Shane, how important is it for you guys to keep, you know, sharp with these three games now the top seed's clinch? I mean, you still want to keep your top seed for the, for the you know, double-A tournament? Almost definitely. I mean, uh, it's a good test for us right here. We have three games left here, and, uh, we just want to keep playing strong and uh, stick to Union Hockey and uh, keep this train going. Mike, talk about your goal. I mean, you, you had a clear look and threw. How many moves did you throw on the goalie there? Uh, you know, he just kind of fumbled the puck, and I ended up getting it at, like, the hash marks. And, you know, I did a couple moves. Uh, He's practiced it all week. Yeah, <laughs> I did it a couple times in practice. It worked really good, so I thought I'd toss it up there in the game. And uh, just a little fake shot back and forehand. Goalie was out of the net, so. Yeah, and when the year started, I mean, could you envision here on February 21st that you guys would be wrapping up things up? Because you know, I think a lot of thought, people thought this would be a team in transition with the you know, number of scoring uh, guys you lost in goal scoring. Well, I think at the beginning of the year you set your you set goals, and um, I think this is one of the first ones that that we, we want to accomplish. So, I mean, it's a goal of ours. Uh, whether or not you know we lost a lot of seniors last year, a lot of key seniors. Uh, we've had freshmen come in, step up. We've had guys who haven't played come right in and step up uh, seamlessly. So um, I think at this point now, it's you know, I think it doesn't really it doesn't really matter. Like I said, uh, going forward, we got the job done, and you know, we got still a lot of work to do. Have you ever had a six-game goal scoring streak before? 
don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Is that your way of saying you don't jinx it? <laughs> Probably. What you're talking about, man. <laughs> Did you guys watch the game today? Canada, U.S.? Yeah, yeah, there's a lot of, uh, <laughs> a lot of passion going on, but, uh... Oh, I see three people shaking their heads, one person smiling. You're surrounded, pal. <laughs> I, I, I mean, it's great, great hockey. I mean, who, who, would, you know, who wouldn't watch that game? It's, uh, a lot of passion in, the, in our room, even, too, about it, so, um, if you guys get a chance, just give it to Kevin Sullivan. <laughs> no, we're American, we're not gonna give it to anybody. <laughs> Anything else, guys? We're good.